Hello, beekeepers, and thank you for joining Woods Bee Co. for another session of Thinking Out of the Box. I'm Alan Woods, and today we're going to look at the life cycle of the worker bee. But before we start, I want to tell you a few interesting facts about the worker bees. All worker bees are females, and they have a life expectancy of only 45 days. So these hardworking ladies literally work themselves to death. They are equipped with special glands used to do specific jobs and are clearly the backbone of the colony. In fact, they perform every job in a hive except for producing new bees. The task of producing new bees is left to a single queen that can lay up to 2,000 eggs a day. In short, the worker bee starts her life as a single fertilized egg. While the eggs in this picture look like tiny grains of rice, they can be somewhat difficult to see with the naked eye. The larva hatches from the egg on day three, where she will spend the next 18 days developing into an adult worker bee. The bees feed the larva royal jelly from day three to day six. During this time, she will receive 143 feedings, about 2 milligrams of bee food, and will get about 2 hours of care from the nurse bees. In this picture, nurse bees feed and care for the larva. On day 9, the bees will close the cell. This is a picture of what the closed cells look like. We call it capped brood. On day 12, the larva matures into the pupa stage where she will continue to develop until she becomes an adult worker bee. On day 21, she emerges from the cell, starting life as a new worker bee. In this picture, a new worker bee emerges from her cell as her sisters welcome her into the world. After emerging from the cell, until her chitin hardens in about four days, she will not be able to fly. However, she immediately contributes to the hive as a worker bee from day one. She jumps right in and began to do what she can. You may be wondering, why is this information necessary for a beekeeper? Please understand that at each stage of a worker bee's life, she is equipped to perform a certain task. If there is a break in the cycle, these tasks must be performed to ensure that the strength of the colony is maintained. While older bees can perform some of these tasks, their inability to perform them as well could hinder the hive, putting the welfare of the colony at stake. Listed are the jobs and ages that worker bees are equipped to fully perform. We will make another video explaining each of these jobs in more detail. Thank you for watching our videos. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel for more beekeeping videos.